I want it to be something that catches your eye so that when you see it, you go, oh, what is this? And you get closer, and then once you're there, I've got you. Plastic. Plastic. Hi, I'm Cindy Pizro, and I am the creator and founder of Upsculpt. I'm an artist. I'm a fine artist, actually. I've been practicing my whole life. And one day, I was walking along the beach on Long Island about 10 years ago, and I found a bunch of plastic, and that just changed the course of my life. Upsculpt is the combination of upcycling and sculpture. What upcycling means is to create something of value that actually has no value. So in our case at Upsculpt, we use marine plastics that we pick up off the beach, and we use it to bring awareness to the problems that are facing the ocean today concerning plastics specifically. That's really our main focus. Look at this, this is what people don't know. I think one of the top 10 things in the world that wash up on the beaches are shoes. I think seeing Cindy just create, like basically, what is it? You know, like out of garbage, these beautiful, amazing sculptures, I, my mind is blown. And then knowing that they come from all these single use plastics that are literally ruining our environment, to me, it's like such a special experience to see the transition and then know that this piece of fine artwork is going to live in somebody's house or business and will be a constant reminder to like take a step back, think about what you're using, how you're using it, your impact in the environment. It's been 10 years and I have to say that yes, as I said before, like I started out being the crazy lady who was cleaning up the beaches and now everybody's cleaning up the beaches around here. I don't know if you guys recognize that straw. Um, and then here's, uh, like, look at this is just like a plastic. It looks like it could be, I don't even. From anything, right? I thought it was going to be like a flaw, one of those fl but plastic like a, flossers. A pail? Uh, maybe a broken up pail, but you can see how things break oh, up in the ocean. definitely from a plastic water bottle. Ugh, yeah. water bottles. That's right, into the bucket. <laughs> into the bucket. <laughs> I think it's sad at first to like realize the impact that we've had as human beings on the environment. Like I'm a really big believer that you can't dwell on the past. You can only really live in the present and, you know, make choices that could positively affect the future. We're giving it a new life so that it inspires somebody to make a small change, right? Like use a reusable water bottle, like bring your own straw, like choose paper over plastic, like little things that you can do in your day to day. I was just an artist that was walking along the beach who picked up materials and just started asking questions. And that's what I want people to do. Find out more about plastic pollution and what you can do where you live in your community.